What's up guys? My name is Kimmy from Q971 and I'm at the SJVC campus to learn about the HVAC program. With me, I have Mr. Reynolds, who is the instructor here for the HVAC program. How are you, Mr. Reynolds? I'm wonderful. How are you doing? I'm so excited to be here because Good. I'm going to learn so much about the program. Now, can you tell me a little bit more about the HVAC? So basically, here in the school, we, uh, we start them out from the very basics when it comes to electricity, refrigeration, and air conditioning. And we'll work them all the way up to the advanced to where they can actually install a piece of equipment themselves. Wow. Um, yeah, so we, our whole goal here through this program is to get them to a point that they are job ready. Well, can you take me to go check out the students working? I want to see exactly what they're getting yeah. into. So Maybe I'll get my hands on something too. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. So explain to me a little bit more about what they're doing over there. So over here, what they're doing is they're working with our oxygen acetylene torch system. Uh -huh. And what they are doing is actually they're brazing. Okay. Uh, and that's a form of welding that we utilize for uh, sealing our system so the Freon, we can keep the Freon trapped Oh my inside. gosh. Now take me inside to this other room. All right. Because I know that they're pretty busy in there. So this is where most of the hands-on stuff takes place. This is our back lab. Okay. Um, so this is our big, big work area here. And uh, we got students doing a variety of things. Um, got some students back here wiring on furnaces. Yeah, so what he's doing here is he's actually wiring up an ignition module for this furnace. Okay. Um, so it, when we when we go to turn this furnace on, it has a way to light the gas inside of the furnace so we can start producing heat. Well, show me what they have going on over here. What we have these students doing here is recharge our recovery and recharge. So anytime that we have to open up a system to do work in the refrigeration end of it, EPA requires us to recover that refrigerant. Um, so it's not released into atmosphere, okay. and then we vacuum, and then they will recharge it with clean refrigerant. It is vital that they understand this because Definitely. they will all be required to take a federal certification test. Well, Mr. Reynolds, you've taught me so much already, but is there something that I can get my hands on? Well... Like something that I can do? I mean, I feel like I learned a little bit already. <laughs> Well, you seem to be a little excited about what they were doing outside there. Mm -hmm. so I got my go goggles on. All right. <laughs> Interesting. And how how hot is it again? Seventeen hundred degrees Fahrenheit. Seventeen hundred degrees Fahrenheit, y'all. All we're gonna do is we're just gonna take this and we're just gonna put it up next to that pipe and we're gonna move it up and down until it starts to get kind of red. It's hot. bending. That's all right. Just a little bit. And then, once it starts to get red hot... It's melting! <laughs> I'm just going to take that solder. That's that so solder. cool. Yeah. Like that. Whoa! Like that. All right? That's awesome. And okay. it's not hot. Just go get a good grip on it. I'm getting okay. it. Okay. And now all you're going to do is you're just going to take that flame, and you're going to put it right on that pipe, and you're going to move it up and down until it starts to turn red. Okay. And as soon as we start to see that thing turn red, then you're going <laughs> to add some rod to it. This is so cool. So now go ahead and touch that rod to that pipe. There you go. Get the torch on it. There you go. Ooh, it's melting. There you go. Hey, this little stick is melting too. Now pull your pull your heat off a little bit. And then there you go. Oh, whoa. That's this crazy. is so Look awesome. That. Look at that nice big blob. You did a better there. job than me, but. <laughs> How was that? But you're a pro. That was so cool. <laughs> so that's staying like that? That's going to stay just like that. In fact, that, that, Whoa, that, 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 that just rod is, going to, off is now. going to cool off and be harder than the actual pipe itself. No way. Yeah, and now I'm going to walk and do this, and I'll show you exactly how <laughs> hot this thing can get. Look at that. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. That's hot. <laughs> That's because you kept it in the same place, right? Yes. yes. That was fast. You yes. did that quick. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> <laughs> That's my first instinct. I want to get... I want to pick it up. <laughs> yeah, so that is brazing. Okay. And that is probably uh, one of the most um, <gasps> one of the it. most demanding skills for the students to learn. Wait, are you guys doing a Q971? Um, They're brazing it together for you. They're brazing it for me. This is so cool. Okay, there it is. I can see the Q, I can see the 9 and the 7. Interesting work back there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, Mr. Reynolds, a pleasure. Well, thank, thank you so you. much for having me. All right. I learned a lot. I love the experience and I got to try a little bit myself too. And it's not easy work because I was like, 
yeah. a little scared that I was gonna <laughs> chop my finger off. <laughs> Thank yeah. you so much once again. Uh, make sure if you love the video, give it a thumbs up. Comment below, ask any questions that you have. Share the video, please, and we'll see you back again. My name is Kimmy from Q971 with Mr. Reynolds, instructor here at the HVAC program at SJBC College.